Hello, in my intermediate school family, I'm Karen, and I'm reporting to you directly from my house. The news crew is so excited to be able to bring you our first virtual episode of the WIS News. We hope it brightens your day. We know this has been a really weird time. School is close, and we're all working hard at home to keep up with our studies. We miss our friends and our teachers and just want to get back to school. But since we're all at home, we thought of some cool ideas and new ways we can include you in our nation. That's right, for our next episode, we would like to meet your pets. So if you have a pet that you love, click on the link in the comments below and make a look great video of you and your pet. This is for IIS students and teachers, and you must be signed in with your school email in order to participate. So send us those cute videos of you and your pets, and you may end up on our next episode. Be sure to get your parents' permission before you record, because our new show is posted on YouTube and social media. Good morning, everybody. I'm Italy, and I want to give you some ideas for fun and games while at home. Being at home all day can get a little boring, so we have some ideas to help you and your family play anytime you want. The game we're going to be featuring today is an old, old game called Huckle Buckle Beanbag. It was invented in the 1800s and it's like a spin-off of an Easter egg hunt. The way you play is you and your family picks one object to hide. It should be something easy to recognize, like a small toy or a household object. It, one person is it and gets to hide the object. Everyone else hides their eyes or goes to a different location while the object is being hidden. Then everyone looks for the object. It start, if it starts to take too long, the person who is it can say when people are getting hot or cold to help them find the object. Whoever finds it, the item next is it in the next round. The cool thing is about this game is that it can be played pretty much anywhere, outside, inside, in one room, or your whole house. It can also be played with any number of people, so just you and one other person or the whole family. It's up to you. Have fun. Now Kayla and Alona for our school news. Hey Kayla. Thanks Helene. Since we don't have regular school announcements, we want to give a special shout out to our teachers and staff members who have been working hard for the past few weeks. While we've been at home, Everyone has been working hard behind the scenes to keep things running smoothly and to help us each step of the way. Our bus drivers and cafeteria workers have been working hard every single day to deliver meals to students in need. Our teachers have been working on lessons so we don't fall behind, and our custodian workers have been cleaning and disinfecting our school. And Mrs. Bush and Mr. Loso, along with the office staff, have been keeping things running smoothly while we're away. And now here with important announcements, Mrs. Bush, Thanks for joining us, Ms. Bush. Hello, IIS family. This is Ms. Bush coming to you from school. I hope that you guys are working hard at home. I want you to know that we miss you and we love you and we're all going to get through this time together. I also want to thank your teachers for the incredible job that they are doing and we're so very proud of them too. I have a special guest with me today that I wanted to share with you. It's my dog, Stormy. Come here, Stormy. <gasps> Look at Stormy. He wanted to say hello to our IIS family. Stormy is a King Charles Cavalier Spaniel, and he is almost 10 years old. And he brings so much joy to our family, and he wanted to say hello. Hello, IIS family. I hope you guys work hard this week. And please know that we miss you and we love you. Bye! Thanks, Miss Bush. That's about all we have for our first new show. Hope you enjoyed it and we brightened your day. Be sure to click on the link below and share your pet with us. You may see yourself on our next episode. Take care and hang in there. I'm Kayla. I'm Elona. I'm Emily. I'm Kieran. And I'm Helene. We'll see you next time.